why didn't any of Jordan's sons make it to the NBA? If it weren't for his unique preferences, Marcus Jordan could have truly become the next Air Jordan. He was already 1.93 meters tall by the age of 14 and had a natural fighting spirit. As a child, his favorite pastime was watching his father play. In high school, he showed his basketball talent, and Jordan personally witnessed his son winning a championship. When the camera focused on Jordan, his eyes were filled with tears as he clapped continuously. In college, Marcus showed his individuality by choosing an obscure school over a host of prestigious ones. On his first day with the team, Marcus directly told the team manager that he would only wear Jordan brand shoes and even told his teammates that if they wanted to wear Jordan brand shoes, they could just ask him for a free pair. Unlike his older brother, who averaged only one point per game, Marcus was a key scorer for his team. In a game against the powerhouse University of Connecticut, Marcus led a comeback from a 17-point deficit, ultimately pulling off an upset victory, showcasing the image of Jordan's son to the fullest. Marcus also took after his dad in the romance department, but had a thing for older women. As a college freshman, he was dating a 26-year-old, seven years his senior. His college years were marked by a wild lifestyle, and he often got into trouble. Jordan would scold him, but Marcus knew his family's wealth meant he didn't have to focus solely on basketball. When his college got suspended for recruiting violations, Marcus decided to quit basketball altogether, which is why none of Jordan's sons ever made it to the NBA. Then in 2022, Marcus shocked everyone by starting a relationship with Larsa Pippen, Scottie Pippen's ex-wife. Their 16-year age gap relationship made headlines, especially since Marcus was just seven years old when Larsa married Pippen. Their relationship quickly escalated, and they began talking about marriage. To top it off, Marcus wanted his father, Jordan, to be his best man at the wedding.